Do you want to optimize your health and fitness while creating a kinder world? I've got you covered with my delicious healthy take on Southern Fried Nuggets. The base for this vegan chicken alternative is Vital Weekly, which is 75% protein by weight. Pretty impressive, huh? And it's a fraction of the price of chicken, so you're saving money and animals. This recipe happens to be oil-free too, so it won't mess with your macros. To a food processor, add 200 grams of silken tofu, 80 grams of vital wheat gluten, half a tablespoon of nutritional yeast, and one tablespoon of chicken seasoning. Pulse until well incorporated. Okay, so we're gonna grab out of here. Just kind of ball it up a little bit. You don't really need to knead it like you normally do with seitan. So now we're gonna break off the pieces. You want them a bit smaller than you think you want the nugget to end up because they will grow a little bit as they're, as they're being steamed, basically. Is that about good, Jim? Mm, yeah. Too big? Maybe a touch big. Yeah. <sighs> <laughs> yeah. Yep, I've done it. You did that quick? Yeah, well, mm. I'm something of an expert. They'll probably expand like twice the size of that or something. Twice like that. the size? I don't know. Anyway. We'll see. Steam for 18 minutes. To a bowl, add 65 grams of gram or besan flour. This is basically made from chickpeas, so it's very healthy. I'm just gonna strain it to get some of the um, clumps out. Then we're gonna add some spices. Let me see if I can remember these. Two teaspoons of garlic powder, half a teaspoon each of cayenne pepper, smoked paprika, onion powder, mustard powder, one teaspoon of garlic, and <laughs> mm. <laughs> it was going so well chili powder. I'm gonna add salt to taste. Now I'm using potassium salt today because there was a lot of sodium in the chicken seasoning and this just helps you to be healthy. We should be in less sodium and more potassium and the way they balance in the body is important for health. So I'm doing that, you do you. I've got half a teaspoon of black pepper also. Give it a little mix up. Then we add 120 mils of soya milk and give it a good old whiskey. Have I done it? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know you ask me for. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why I don't get you to do these recipe videos. You're the thinking chef around here. It's really just so you can look at my muscles. Look at his muscles. <laughs> look at these guys. <laughs> What's next, mate? Put some breadcrumbs in a bowl. We're what going. Bowl? We're going for these ones. <laughs> Put them in that one. Oh, that's too small. Is it? Okay. Come on. I'll go I know you're tired, but I'll go. On. I'll go and get another. Come on, you lazy. <laughs> <laughs> Add 60 grams to a bowl. Preheat your oven to 200 degrees Celsius, that's 400 Fahrenheit. And while you're there, remove the nuggets from the heat and set aside to cool. Once the seitan nuggets have cooled sufficiently so that you can handle them, we're going to pop them in the batter, then in the breadcrumbs, and then we're going to line them on a sheet of parchment paper on top of a baking tray. Cook in the oven for 15 minutes, flipping halfway. Before I do the taste test and let you know the wonderful macros of this meal, just a quick word about our online coaching. So we've currently spaced for one or two new clients. If you've been going it alone for the longest time, maybe you're trying to lose fat, build muscle, or just get healthy, or all three, and you're not cutting it alone, consider hiring me and Gemma to do your online coaching for you. We'll work out nutrition and if necessary workout plans bespoke to you as an individual to optimize your results. We'll leverage an app to chart your stats. You can DM there daily, but we'll also do a weekly Zoom call where you get held accountable, make any tweaks to the plan to make sure it's working as it should. Um, we've only spaced, as I say, for a small amount of people because it's so in depth. So we only want people who are really serious about getting results. So if that's you, click the link below. And now the taste test. Which is your favorite sauce? Comment below. I'm a barbecue sauce man. Such intense flavors as you'll see. There's <laughs> spat everywhere. Super high in protein, really amazing as a bodybuilder meal. Whether you're trying to build muscle, burn fat, this will be a good cornerstone. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video, guys. Barbecue sauce again, I think. Hmm.